Welcome to Tomahawk DIY, everyone. Today we're going to take a look at a laptop that's been getting really hot. Uh, you ever have these things sitting on your lap and it just feels extra hot on the bottom here? Well, there's a couple things to be aware of. Uh, air passes through these and there's a fan that uh, runs and blows the air out over here. So sometimes that gets dirty. And then also it's a uh, it's a good idea to not set this uh, straight on your lap or, or not just leave it sitting on a pillow or a blanket or something, but rather have a hard a book or a laptop stand uh, sitting under it to help allow the air to move more freely through and keep the, uh, keep the processor cool. So, if it's getting hot on you, here's a quick and easy way to fix it. First, we're going to pull the battery out. That's done simply by rolling these. We'll set the battery aside. And right here is the fan. Most laptops are going to have a fan. You'll look on the bottom, you'll be able to see it through the grate fairly well. And uh, the vent, if you hold your hand out to the side of the vent, you'll often you'll be able to feel um, air blowing out. So oftentimes what will happen is a lot of dirt and dust and grime and hair and all sorts of things will get sucked in through this fan over time. And it will build up on the heat exchanger that cools. So let's take a look at an easy way to clean this. First, I'm going to take a dusting can. You can buy these at a hardware store, you can buy them on Amazon. I'll include a link down below. Um, and we're going to spray right in the fan to try and help clean things out. Another thing that you can do is get a bright flashlight and look in through the slots on the side here. That will give you an idea of where the dust is built up. You should be able to see it and should be able to see it as it starts breaking free mm -hmm. as you spray it with the, uh, with the dusting air. The next thing we're going to do is actually use a vacuum. So I've got the wand of the vacuum here and let's see what we can do to suck things out. Alright, so with all that uh, dusting, I don't know if you can see here, but we've actually shaken a little piece of dust apart, or loose from, from inside. So there's going to be a whole lot of this dust in there. Try that vacuum and see if we can get some more, some more of this out. I can see a whole big wad of dust right under the grate here. All right, I think I got it. If that doesn't work, again, check out the playlist. A uh, fairly simple. A straightforward way to try on a first pass at getting the heat exchanger uh, cleaned out so your fan works better, so your computer stays cooler, so you don't burn your lap, and so you don't burn your computer up. Uh, though computers oftentimes will have a safety in them, so they uh, will shut off if it's getting too hot, which is what mine has started doing recently. So, thanks for watching Tomahawk DIY. Have a great day. Like the video, leave some comments, and don't for forget to subscribe.